happy rainy Tuesday, you guys. It is just gross. It's gross outside. It's been pretty, pretty weird all day. Check it out. Just a gray blanket above us. And it's been fairly, uh, did I just get water on the camera? I think I did, crap. It's been fairly gloomy all day, but the new um, wind chimes have been going like nonstop. They sound awesome. So yeah, uh, hopefully your day started a little bit better than mine. I totally just dropped all these eggs and broke them, most of them. So I'm gonna try to salvage what I can. I will probably end up eating one of these. This little lone guy rolled all the way over here and he was totally fine. Well, ding dang. All right, so that really wasn't so bad. I just used all the eggs that broke. So I'm gonna have three eggs for breakfast or lunch really. And then these three didn't break. So there you go. <laughs> if you're doing like an egg drop type science project, maybe use this as part of your design because it helped half of the eggs. 50-50, all right. <sighs> In the commotion of trying to save the eggs that broke, I forgot to spray the pan down with like my, you know, my butter spray so that it doesn't stick and all the eggs broke anyway. <laughs> yeah, this is, I think I'm just gonna go back to bed. I, what? Why? I was able to save two of my eggs, so uh, that's pretty, pretty, pretty big win. Maybe I will stay awake for the rest of the day. Uh, but yeah, so there you go. They're crisis averted. And another crisis is averted. I guess it's not really a crisis, but I don't really want this egg white stuff like all over my, um, my fridge. So I just cut the piece out for the three eggs and I'm just going to put them in like this. Hopefully to help them not break because, um, I think just three loose eggs in your fridge is probably not a good idea. But yeah, so then I can just throw all this away and good to go. So that was my excitement for the morning. <laughs> but, uh, but yeah. Yay for problem solving. Oh, check out little, oh, oh, he, Tim's calling me. Well, hold on. I gotta, I gotta show you guys how cute Bean is, right Bean? Uh, I just love you so much. You're so cute. You are adorable. Man, I had plans to take over the world today, but no, it's gotta rain. What the heck? Oh, the pool's like super full. That's awesome. And so as you guys can see, it is a terrible day outside. So we're gonna try to figure something fun to do inside probably end up watching a movie but we certainly will try because that's like our new year's resolution before the new year is to try to do something fun more often right but we still have this disney movie kick going that we have to get through and we've been procrastinating on bambi because bambi's so sad so uh, we'll figure it out soon as you guys know we are pizza fiends and pizza hut has this new menu which they also have new shirts which i thought were really funny because they're like Nobody ever has a sandwich party because everybody has pizza parties, which That's I thought funny. was really funny. Uh, but these are like cheesy flavor sticks, I think they called them. These are some sort of jalapeno filled potato things. And this is pepperoni and mushroom with like some sort of crazy Parmesan flavoring. What kind of flavoring is this, Jen? It's called the Hut Favorite. And it's, it's just like butter and Parmesan and garlic. But I thought it was gonna be on the crust. Apparently it's all over the pizza, everywhere. Yeah, I didn't realize that. I think it'll be good though. I'll enjoy it. And we got this bottle of Champagne for Jen's birthday. We never popped it. I said, uh, oh, we gotta go open this bottle of champagne. And then we never actually did that. I think we played beer pong instead, so. And then I fell asleep on the couch dressed as a ninja turtle. Yeah. All right, I'll watch my eyes. Okay. Pop them bottles in the club. Like three, six. Ah. Right? Yeah. I'm a rapper. <laughs> More like a candy wrapper, right? And we're finally catching up on Walking Dead. Carl! We're done watching Walking Dead, like, one of those terrible episodes where, like, super tense, but nothing actually happens. Yay. But for Jen's birthday party, we got these Blue Moon, like, variety packs. And one of the beers that came in it was Cinnamon Horchata Ale. What the heck? Why would you make a beer? Why wouldn't somebody just drink horchata? Right? Like... I don't understand what like the trend is with making beers taste not like beers. Like at that point you would just get something else, like a lemonade, like a hard cider or something. I don't understand it. I didn't like it at all. I know I told you guys we were gonna do something exciting tonight, but I ended up falling asleep and watching Off Limits. My goodness, it's just been gotten nonstop all night. The pool might overflow, that's fun. On that note, I'm gonna go to bed because this rain is like putting me to sleep. It's like a wonderful lullaby. So, I will see you guys tomorrow. Now it's time to pay the price.